Hi guys, welcome to a video which I've been really excited to do. It's uh, taken a while to get it onto YouTube because my set didn't arrive till today, which is a day later than everyone else. So without further ado, we're looking at the Jungles of Mechanus set, the newly released set by Character Options. It is limited edition to uh, 5,000 units, and I believe they're nearly sold out, so go grab one before they're gone. The box is slightly larger than the B&M Dalek boxes, and as you can see, it's the same style, apart from it's not got the B&M sticker, it's got a Character Online exclu exclusive in there. We spin it around. We have a nice picture of the Daleks on the back and an info segment on the chase, which these Daleks were from blatantly. So let's get these cracked open and let's have a look at them. Before we look at the Daleks, I just thought you'd like to have a look at the backdrop inside the, uh, the packaging. So we've got the the fungoids from mechanus we have some props down here which i think they look like studio lights that have just been left on the floor to use as props they might be from another story but i don't recognize them ones in particular i think someone said something about planet of evil or something like that we have got something red in the corner down there um, a bracelet. I think that's from Blake 7 or something, possibly. And on this side here, we have a bomb from Spiridon, Planet of the Daleks. And then, of course, this, this side piece, which is the, uh, the police box, the TARDIS. So, let's move that to one side and bring in the Daleks themselves. Now, here they are. They are obviously Dalek Invasion of Earth Daleks without the, the, the ears that they usually have. They've been changed and updated with these movie beakers. They don't have the fender on top of the, the large fender, so they have just the large fender. The gun is the 80s gun, so the ones that were on the Remembrance Daleks, as they have the straight rods. The bodywork, the actual main body, is like a, a bluey silver, which is spot on. It's perfect to uh, to represent the, the movie or the Chinese Daleks. That same blue has been carried onto the plunger arm, which does look a bit odd when you see the, the silver ball joints, because um, if I get it, to, uh, get it to focus on that... Uh, it sort of goes from bluey, silver, and then back to bluey. But um, a minor detail. The belts are a yellowy gold, which is very nice. And the fender itself is a light blue. Slightly too light, I'd say. But close enough. Now, the darker blue, I still feel is a little bit too dark on these and not quite metallic enough. That's the only thing that I really don't like about these. Um, I'll do a comparison with my own customs in a moment. Uh, but before I do, I just want to also point out that on the dome, these uh, new dome lights, I don't know if it's going to be like this on um, all of them, but on these ones, this one's like an orangey colour, and this one's a red colour. Now I think that's just the because some have been cast up with less red pigment. But on this particular one, we have a darker one and a lighter one, which looks really odd. And also, on the end, it's just flat, which is very peculiar, because I'm pretty sure the Daleks the beakers they used on the movie Daleks, they had a, a ring that dipped in a bit on the end. Which, if I bring my... 
customs into view, I can show you the differences. So, these are the two side by side, and I'll show you the, the dome lights, what I was on about. So, these dome lights are 100% accurate, and they have a slight dip there. And they have the same detailing, just, there's just a lot more detail in the ones I've made myself. And obviously I've gone for the, the metallic blue dome. And I have, there's a side by side there. And I've gone for a slightly more metallic-y washed out gold for the belts to make them look more realistic. But, uh, but they're, they're, they're a good representation. They're a good, they're a good product if you want to army build them at an affordable price. Uh, so if I put these back a moment, I'll bring in the red and black Dalek. Let's move them slightly like this, just to create a nice thumbnail, I guess. But they finish the set off nicely. And yeah, they do really look the part in the in the uh, in the background there. So yeah, re really happy with the set. I highly recommend picking it up before it sells out. And um yeah, enjoy your purchases.